Hi, I'm Nick Strain. I'm Senior Wealth Advisor at Halbert Hargo and wanted to share some of the highlights from the tax reform bill that passed at the end of the year. The new standard deduction is almost going to be doubled from previous year. The individual level will be $12,000 a year and for married couples will be $24,000 a year. One of the biggest changes that will affect high earners and also property owners is only up to $10,000 will be deductible for state and local taxes. So that will include income taxes at the state level and also property taxes. So again, up only up to $10,000, whereas before, all of those taxes would be fully deductible at the federal level. The other major change that's happening is each of the marginal tax rates is being decreased uh, slightly for each of the categories. An interesting change is taking place around the 529 plan and its rules regarding distributions. Previously, uh, distributions from 529 plans could only be used for college or qualified higher education expenses, and now they can be used for K-12 for private and religious schools. The last item we wanted to highlight today was regarding new home purchases and the deductibility of mortgage interest. Under the old rules, mortgages up to a million dollars could be deducted. Under the new rules, only interest of 750,000 mortgage balances can be deducted. These were the top things that we think are applicable to most clients, uh, but it'll be important for you to reach out to your CPA and to us to discuss all of the changes that might affect you going forward.